Johnny. It's gotta work. We breached the tower. All cracks open with ah. Koshi. Then I up that. Great, you checking out again? Bruh, I just exploded! What do you want from me? <laughs> Jessica and welcome back to Cyberpunk 2077. I'm about to head in and meet up with Hanako Arasaka. This is the final main mission of the story, so I believe this is gonna be my final video on uh, Cyberpunk 2077, at least for the main Let's Play. I know there's DLC coming out in the future. I'm a little bit nervous because I don't really know what to expect um, in terms of like what kind of ending I'm gonna have for V. Alright, let's go to Embers. I'm kind of scared. Whoa! What's happening? God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. <sighs> yeah. This porcelain is the worst kind of news. I'll, I'll be careful, okay? I know, I know you don't careful. like them. I understand. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, I know, first side Johnny. Of trouble, we dealt her. Okay, Johnny. You know what? I kind of agree with him. Like, I'm not saying, like, uh, Takimura, like, put us in a trap or anything. Because he knows Hanako, right? He, he, he's the bodyguard of the family. Oh, okay. Th thank you. I, I don't want to discount what Johnny's feeling. She emptied the place. Because I understand he has personal beef with them, too, right? I don't want to be like, yo, I don't care about your problems, what happened to him. But remember what I said in the last video. Johnny's memories may not be exactly what they seem. He may not be remembering right because, you know, a lot of stuff happened before he died. So I'm just going to be trying to be optimistic that Hanako is not terrible as her brother. But you never know. She may be horrible as him. We expected a VIP guest today. Cancel all current reservations, adding a personal touch for each so that we don't anger the regulars. Please emphasize to the staff the future of Embers may depend on this visit. And it's because of Hanako. Hey, what's going on, dude? Johnny, I'll be okay. Why is that guy floating? Is that guy floating? Excellent. <laughs> you have come. You know what? I'm gonna be Corpo right now. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Okay. You weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father, no? I knew from the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not what? Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Oh, okay, okay. Details were just- I mean, it, that's the thing, he didn't really try to cover up as a lie, because even uh, Takimoto was like, how did he get poisoned? I was just with him like five seconds ago. Didn't do anything about it, why? You're no better than your brother. <clears throat> so why Is didn't you do anything about order? it? You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. Okay. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Power, family, the corp idea. Uh, family? I don't know. Ties that bind. Yes, family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh? Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. Are we giving him a pass? I know he's your brother, but damn, it's that's okay? I do not expect you to understand. I don't! I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm-hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. 
warning. They grew yet greater in your hideout, when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yurinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. Oh, okay, he so... He never cared for us. I was right! Yorinobu was, was waiting a moment to kill his family. sister, too. It but just make it look like Arasakas an accident. To listen to their heart. What a dick. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Wait a second. See him on edge? Something got you spooked? I... don't know. Three what? times now that AB has flown by. Yeah. Think someone might have tailed you? We must not get distracted. Did you bring Soul Killer? I don't know if I should give it to her. I'm not saying I don't trust Johnny, but like it's kind of weird how this whole thing is set up. I'm just saying. So I'm, I'm, I kind of want to lean towards Johnny. Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. I'm sorry, but we I don't know you, and I know how to Takimura's not here to help me. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wait, wait, Johnny, let Wanna me hear leave. her out. What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. I'm not trying to this push him away. I just want to hear what she has to say first. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? What's Smells that like careful not to step in it he must be made to take responsibility for his deeds you really think that are you hiring me to get your brother but the thing is like i don't mm. i don't know how this is gonna play out want to avenge your father responsibility you want to kill your baby bro mm -hmm. i don't think it's even about it's avenging her, order. her father either i feel like this is something more than that just say it be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. It's more I so for Arasaka trying to kill her than to know him, truth. right? How you plan to do this? Or the family name? Yorinobu. What? Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. I don't think brother. that's gonna work! No, no, testify. no. Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? I don't think that's gonna work. Help me get rid I'm of a your merc! Enough. And I was I help you get rid broke of the into the building illegally. How the hell is that gonna work out? Hey, I watched your your boss kill his father in front of um in front of me. Why was I there? Oh, because I was stealing the relic. And like, how is that gonna look good for V? I <laughs> like, need to return to the estate soon, so as not to raise any suspicions. Girl, no. Want me to throw Yorinobu under the bus in front of our Saka top brass? Call me crazy, but that sounds like suicide. This I know. And that is why we will take all the necessary precautions. I... Like... I, I don't think as. so. You will see. I'll see what? I'll see the prison cell or maybe I'll be going back to the landfill of dead. Let's assume it works. What the heck are you then talking what? about? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. Yeah, apparently. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. No wish or permission, okay, your biz. I know my place, too. Know my place, too. Know exactly where I came from. Maybe. Once it's all said and done, I'll find my way back there. Perhaps. 
If you can prove your value. Whoa, what's happening? Jesus, I'm gonna f puke. Johnny, you alright? So. Honestly, I don't like this. I'm being real. Don't like it this sounds like a trap all. to me. Sounds like you. She may be innocent me. and everything, but no. I don't trust her brother to be like, I hey, let's listen to what she has to say. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. We're getting the fuck out of here. I kind of agree with Johnny. Are you well? Yeah, it's just, uh, you are bleeding. Oh, fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. No worries about that. V? Johnny? You could use some air right now. Yo, we have to get out of here. I don't like this. Everything just- <laughs> Oh my god. Everything just- just seems- I don't know, like, not right. Okay, okay, let's get out of here. I warned you. What, what are you doing? What? We could be hours from it now, me. You can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. Johnny, what are you doing? See what I'm getting at? You want to take over, not me. Of course I can see. You want me to hand over the keys. I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. Johnny, I- I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. I know you will. It's just the problem is how you're going to do that. Without that's that the part that scares me. Help. That's for damn sure. How? Stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she just stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now- I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. I know. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower. That's the part like I don't like when you say day, blast, okay? <laughs> I don't like it when you say it like that, Johnny. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on our Asaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. Not saying you that the Alda Caldos can't help, pros. but he kind of has a point. They don't better. know how to handle the corpos like we you do. You don't want those people involved. They've They're never dealt with the Arasaka. On Only conscience. Biotechnica, remember? So. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offers on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, God, the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Our ticket, huh? Okay, I see your angle. You think working with the Corpo is gonna sweeten the deal? Well, let me tell you something. The Corpo kleptocracy is not an option. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Oh my god. You really think Rogue gi gives you a shot? Johnny, I don't know. Because I don't know what you're gonna do. And I don't know what Rogue is gonna do. I, it's not that I don't trust her. I, she clearly has, like, stuff that she needs to deal with first before, like, helping Johnny. Because she she's not mentally, like, you know, all there. Because I, I know she feels guilty. Johnny, on the other hand, I don't know if he can control his anger when it comes to Arasaka people. That's- that's the only difficult part I'm having trusting Johnny. I don't think he has the capability of controlling his anger and like what happened to him. He has every right to be because he's been in prison here, you know, essentially being an experiment and killed. I understand that, but dude! Rogue? I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections... Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny. It's gotta work. We breach the tower. All cracks open, ah. Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? 
Bro, I just exploded. What do you want from me? <laughs> like... <laughs> no, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. What happened then? Huh? Easy there. <gasps> Victor! Yet. I haven't seen him in so long. Vic. You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh... Almost done stabilizing the biochip. No, feels like someone's using your head as a knife block. How? How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table. Damn. And demanded you be treated immediately. Talent was your guardian angel. It was Johnny. Huh? I, uh, I wasn't completely. Wait, did he hear so. that? Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. How bad is it? What's the diagnosis, Vic? I'll order a weaker drink next time. <laughs> Tell Just me the give truth. Give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Try sitting up, carefully. Okay, but don't expect a miracle. <sighs> so slowly. <sighs> Another victory for the history books. Hmm. What? If you got something Just say, to say it, please, Vic. Victor. Just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Oh, I didn't see Misty back Looking there. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrizin there. A gift from Misty. Oh. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. So I have to decide if I'm gonna let Johnny take you control or not. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. I don't even know myself what I want. Enough, Johnny. I just... I gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, Just not in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Oh shit! Like Johnny's out literally loud. what? Worst. Just go fix this thing. I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. I'm literally he. I'm just him now. Wait. Say, who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh, was it? No, nope, never does. You mean in... It's a rerun. One i like to go back to. Why'd you get so mad, then, if you already knew who won? Oh, no, really. I guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but it feels a little strange to call that a mistake. It's like he's talking about me. 
Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Beck. Only wish I could have done more. No, you've done Go a lot. Now. I want to close up. Oh, Victor, you're such a good Take friend. The and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there too. Hey V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Where? Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. I'm not mad at Victor. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. Okay. Let me guess. <laughs> My aura is sputtering. I think he's just upset. Because, mm -hmm. so. you know, we're his friend, so of course. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. Jackie! It's not far. <laughs> I miss Jackie. him. What's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Why? I miss Jackie. At that time like this, I- oh, Damn, he would've had great advice, wouldn't he? Uh, Top floor. Okay. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Oh. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but he found the courage to bet on himself. After, I brought him here. Oh, okay, so she's the one who helped decide for him, and I guess Missy's gonna help decide uh, what to do. Ah, that's more like it. Air. Yep. See that? Wait, can I sit? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Thanks, Misty. You were right. Choice spot. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought oh, you okay. were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. This is so fucked up! Not what you expect. No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, Judy. now's the time. Pills can wait. Well, you know, Johnny, I, I actually appreciate you letting me call my girlfriend, like... Yo, you're like a bro, thank you. Judy. Yeah, even I've grown to like her. Aww. She ought to know that. I'm gonna cry. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, B. What's cracking? Time we, uh, went swimming. <laughs> a lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. High time I faced it. Can't be sure it'll work, but I gotta try. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Judy. Do my best. She's still optimistic <sighs> that we'll be okay. Oh my okay. god! What's good you called? Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. Yeah, you were shoving <laughs> me you to the floor. To <laughs> yeah. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your 
conscience. I don't really like the idea of going to Hanako's plan because I feel like that's a trap. No offense to Takimura, I love Goro a lot, but I feel like he has like a biased side about everything because he belongs to Arasaka, or I should say, actually he belongs to Arasaka, he works there, right? So he has a different point of view. We used to be Corpro, we know how easy it is for everyone to betray everyone. Pan Am, I trust her. The Elder Caldos too, they're very capable. What, but the thing is what Johnny just said, you're gonna have their souls weighing on your conscience. I wouldn't want any of our friends to get killed for us. Johnny's our friend, but technically he's not alive, so that's why it's okay. Ironically enough, I do think Johnny and Rogue are the best chance I get. What I'm just scared of is how extreme is Johnny gonna get, because I know he has a lot of anger in him for these people. I do wholeheartedly believe that he does care about V, that he wants to at least try to save her. I don't think it would be like his number one priority, but I know it's something that he wants to try to do. I trust her too, cause like I- not to the point like we're buddies or anything, but she has history with Arasaka, Ada Smasher. Um, so I feel like he, she would want to help Johnny to redeem herself for what she has done, that I'm presuming that she betrayed uh, Johnny in order to keep her life safe. But I just think that letting Johnny take over is the best option. I just hope that he doesn't go crazy. Because I am worried about that. <laughs> like, I still have a girlfriend, dude. Please don't do this. I'm gonna trust him. I'm wholeheartedly gonna trust him and see where this takes us. I'm scared. I think you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. I know. Could also put all this to rest. I am. Do your thing, Johnny. Nope. I trust you, Johnny. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Oh. Take the wheel. Just go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, B. Please don't be dumb. I'll get us through this. You'll see. Johnny, please don't be dumb. We had a heart-to-heart -heart at your gravesite. Don't do this. <laughs> See you on the other side. That's right. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city down. See, that's the part I was worried about. Him going, I'm gonna burn everything down. <laughs> Shit. Oh my god, Johnny, please don't. Fuck. Do we have? Johnny. Johnny, don't. Oh my god, I'm, like, I'm already feeling like I'm kind of afraid of this. How you doing? You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V. V's taking a break. It's me. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Expect this to like interrupt him. Oh my god, he's such a dick. Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me. Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies. It's kind of awkward. We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something, and that's always a bad sign. Yes. Of course I do. And who better could I take it to? Out of that whole crazy crew from Atlantis, by some crazy coincidence, only you survived. The hell's that supposed to mean? Oh, shit. Johnny, don't tell me you're gonna get revenge on Rogue. You're wasting my time. Just thinking back. Miss the old times at all, Rogue? Fine with where they are, fine with where I am. I can see that. Shame no one else from the Atlantis had the same luck. Called for whom the bell tolls. We ain't finished yet. Oh yes, you is. Oh, she's shutting down everything. What's the matter? 
Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'ma go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves? Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? That my bottle behind the bar? Yep. Been waiting there. Just... I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. <laughs> By smashing it over my head. <laughs> you chose a cozy life. Just curious what it costs. Let's see your card. It says, I think you sold out... I think you sold it to the corpse. Pick up a pace. I'm gonna be straight up honest. I That is my theory. I do believe that she made a deal with Arasaka, Adam Smasher, in order to give Johnny so that she's protected in the end of all of this. Because it, if you really think about to the flashbacks, she was mad at Johnny. Remember when we put the bomb and he's like, wait, I gotta go do something. I'll be right back. And then Johnny left. She was already pissed off at him because she said, you never took this whole crusade seriously. It was always about your own agenda, your own mission. You never really cared about taking down the corpos or anything. But it's ironic because if Rogue did take a deal with the corpos, doesn't that kind of invalidate her mission to take them down? I don't know. It's just a lot of hypocrisy around. Listen, Rogue, just show me your hand. I know you sold out. You really think... Fuck. Since when are my professional choices any of your fucking business? When I died? When Johnny died? name at the tip of your tongue. I know. Adam Smasher. So, yes. But way later. You were gone and I'd stop dressing in morning. No room for sentimentality in the biz, Johnny. Smasher, me, we work for the same people. Does it stink like fresh shit? Yes. Did I have a choice? I did. Do I regret it? Very much so. Yeah, I figured that as much. That's why she couldn't like- That what you wanted to hear? Continue the romance or even hang no, out hey. with him. The past. He's the past. If that's Johnny, the I don't know about Didn't that. Talk about the future. I know you. Came here for a reason. He's dying. She needs my help. This body. I'm trying to. I. No. Fuck. V's dying, and I'm the fucking cancer killing her. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to. No, Johnny. Don't start. What? Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you, so you can feel better. You sure about that? Yeah. Same as it was with Alt. Damn! You don't even bring her up! Guilt, that. Just some fucking sense of personal discomfort. Okay, no offense, Rogue, I don't agree with you. I know Johnny's an idiot, he's a huge asshole, and he's very selfish. That's pretty fucking clear in his storyline, but I said this. I genuinely feel like he feels so guilty about Alt. That is the reason why he decided to join Rogue and all of them to do this whole crusade in the beginning. Because Johnny had no direction in his life, honestly. He was always about anti-government, anti-corporation, all, all of that. It's, it's in his music, you know what I mean? And the whole theme of this game, cyberpunk, I mean, that should be obvious. It's in the fucking title. But the thing is, like, I don't think Johnny had a reason to push himself to do it. You know, there's a lot of people out there, especially right now, who talk about wanting to do good things, but they don't actively try to do anything. And I'm not saying you necessarily have to, but you know what I mean? Those people who are very loud about being like, we have to do this, blah, 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 but they don't try to like find a way to help. I feel like that's kind of, that's the kind of person Johnny was back in the day. He would talk about it in his music and everything like that, but he never explicitly done anything because he had no direction until alt came along and pushed him to do it and when she died that was the moment where he's like i have to do something now because the, everything that they were fighting for everything they were talking about is coming true you know what i mean so that's that's kind of the way i see it i do think johnny has changed though from like playing this entire game i again i'm still scared about his anger his revenge arc because i don't know how he's gonna react when we come up to adam smasher if we come up to him but i genuinely believe he does care about v 
I know I'm picking the choices, but I can hear it in his speech, especially when they went to his gravesite at the oil rig, the way he was talking about how V is actually his only friend, how he wish, you know, he could have fixed things with Rogue, Alt, and everybody in the band. And even the last thing where he's like, I'm glad you did you did that phone call to Judy, because he's like, I wish I did that too. He's trying to correct all the wrongs that he did with V. So he wasn't able to save Alt, maybe he can save V. So that's kind of like some redemption for him, for Alt, and pretty much uh, everything that he was fighting for. Because he said at the gravesite, I didn't expect a monument or flags or whatever, but it's like he fought for nothing. And that's why he was upset. Nobody really remembers Johnny or the samurai, like the band. Everybody remembers Johnny Silverhand as the terrorist. You look at Victor at the beginning of the game, he's like, you have a terrorist in your head. Nobody talked about him being him, the being the rock star, you know, being an asshole. Like, you know what I mean? Nobody talks about any other quality except for Johnny being a terrorist. That's it. And that's the sad thing because even though, yeah, I don't agree that they should have bombed Arasaka Tower because they killed a lot of people. It's just sad because I feel like that quote from Batman, Harvey Dent, where he's like, when you live uh, long enough to see yourself become the villain. And that's essentially what happened to Johnny. It's just unfortunate the way that it turned out because his intentions, even with Rogue, like what they were trying to do was good, but it just turned out bad. And then now it, it leads up to this and Johnny has no sentiment for himself, nothing left behind. And only guilt is with him and anger. That's the only thing that's left over. And that's why he's such a dick when he's talking to V. But I genuinely think he's trying to save himself now in this moment to be like, I can at least help her because I couldn't do that 50 years ago. So I genuinely believe he's changed, but that's just my opinion. That's the way I played this storyline, right? It could be different for other people's playthrough. And obviously you guys watching right now, you may have a different opinion about Johnny and the way that he's perceiving himself in this game. But that's how I see him. That's so I believe he's changed. Well, maybe I've changed. I'm running out of time, Rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of her head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. The data fort. Mikoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Sokka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. I mean, yeah, ironically, right? <laughs> only an idiot does the same thing over and over while expecting we're the, we're things that to work idiot. out differently. So what do you say? Do you even have a plan for this? That's why I came, uh, that's where you came in, need people and gear, fuck plans, when have they ever helped us? I mean, he's not wrong there too. Both, both having a plan and not having a plan is a terrible idea in, uh, Night City, it seems. So, uh, can I be honest? Oh, Christ, see, that's what's wrong with kids these days. Everybody's <laughs> always asking about some fucking plan. It ever been different? Back in the day, you snorted some lines, grabbed your iron, and did what needed doing. And that's why it worked. And it'll work for us now. Hang on. Us? Can't possibly do it without you. Really want to miss out on a chance like this? No, Rogue. Rogue, this is your chance to redeem yourself, too. I know she feels guilty that's as right. well. Can't possibly work without you. So, what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? You... It's not to Johnny, it's to herself. Johnny's dead, you know what I mean? I know he's a construct in her head. And he may be pissed off about her selling out to the corpos and whatever, but what's done is done. It's about her. Owe it to yourself. Is that so? Sure, you can just be the queen of the ball in Night City. But that's not the real rogue. The real rogue you buried while I mean, her name is Rogue. <laughs> Look deep. I know you can find her again. 
Shit. Knew this would happen one day. What, what, what's happening? That one night, by some fucking miracle, you waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us? Have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Oh! Oh, okay! Damn, all Will right. You lend me a hand. Shut the fuck up, Johnny. <laughs> Just stop talking. Oh my god. Uh Who am I now? Am I V or Johnny? Oh my Fucking god, Christ. Christ. What the fuck? <laughs> Every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as I paid. Oh, this is not my apartment. I think this hours. is a uh, rogue's apartment. Uh oh, I 20 hours later. Face. We're still Gotta in afterlife. Crispin Wayland. Spitting, Spitting image. image of your dad. Blood of the blood. Well, what did I miss? Why are you here? The boss will explain all. Okay, hey, where is she? There is only one boss. Big boss, Let's Metal go. Gear. <laughs> the boss awaits. Oh wow! Look at that. And that's his dad, right? See you two said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? Specimen. He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Our ride. So you're in. Don't act all surprised, leadhead. <laughs> Gears over there. Help yourself. Oh, okay, thank you. Don't mind if I do. Whoa! Give me that one. What are these? Retro thrusters. Anti-grips. Ooh! Strap them to your legs, and you can jump from damn near any height. Christ, Johnny, I'm not your fucking babysitter. <laughs> They're mine. Got it. Okay now. Gonna tell me what the plan is? Yep. Jack in the shard. Uh, okay. Targets the Mikoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress. The yep. most secure building in Night City. Especially what Walking happened 50 years ago? Walking in the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti -grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building. We use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. Oh, I haven't been the there since V the uh, worked there in the beginning. For applause. I know that. I recognize the floor. There's only one boss, one queen. Mm -hmm. Sheesh, didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. Guess now it is so red Mezutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Enough <laughs> said. Now focus on the plan. Yes, ma'am! Kinda worried though, like what if our plan doesn't work? But then again, we some fuck plans, right? Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously? I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we gotta do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. What? We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 Comsat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite! We gonna make history friends! That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, 
New support. Damn, we're gonna knock out Free everything chaos. for the entire city. Mean to tell me that apart from that <laughs> fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle? Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. Mystery benefactor. She has connections to Highly everybody. Informant. Damn. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean Alt? Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Contacts at Orbital Air, eh? You really are the queen of fixers. Better be grateful. Called on my best assets for you. No, I actually am. Like, wow. I I'm very impressed. All this up while I was asleep? Actually, I brooded up while you were dead. Oh. A finger in the comms network pie when corp conflicts start to heat up again could be worth gold. Because nothing stands to make you more at ease than more. I'll convince all. Could be tough. Alt's new netwatch uh, on her ass. Yeah, netwatch is on her ass, and also it's not really alt. <laughs> so that's another thing. I can try to sway alt, but no promises. Unfettered AI, remember? She can be difficult. Still got the watch on her ass too. Besides, bringing down a satellite might not make her happy. I could give a shit about her feelings. I'm the one taking most of the risks here. Okay, I mean, Either you yeah. convince Cunningham, or I'm out. I or said I'd try. Christ. <laughs> so summing up, we fly to Arasaka Tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical oh, axis, to. and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? See, just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. You okay with that? All Arasaka's gonna be gunning for you. Yeah. Probably Orbital Air will too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. So? So she's really okay with think? this. Plans got more gaping holes than a kabuki dollhouse. Jesus, Johnny, please. <laughs> Fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just thank you. Damn, he said thank thanks. You. You're still the matter of. Johnny's changed, I'm telling you. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? No. V got some practice under her belt. Sure, I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. Oh god, we gotta talk to Alt. And you, Wayland, heat up the Strix. We'll be with you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> hey, so you the one gonna die, right? Yup. That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit. Then have a seat over there. I'm finishing up for the day. So you be resurfacing on your own. And don't fuck with my gear. Can't say any promises because I don't know what Johnny's gonna do. <laughs> Alright, let's see how Johnny can handle this. I told you, Alt Cunningham is no more. That's so? Then why do I see her in front of me? You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Like Having I'm... a bad dream. You read my thoughts? An oversimplification. You still deny what you are. A construct. A set of data. Yeah, Johnny hasn't I accepted. Know you. You know me. Huh? Like lines of code. What does that mean? So why even bother talking if you know my thoughts? As action precedes reaction, so Johnny Silverhand speaks before he thinks. Huh. That's some kind of joke? 
Only a sliver of memory from Alt's sense of humor. So what else do you know? The complexity of your emotions. Time is short. Netwatch could detect our local net traffic. I want to get a Makoshi. Know about satellites? How much you know about satellites? Did you God won that. Zero four zero one. I can manage it. Holy fuck, you're doing it now. You're reading I my... I agree with the plan. Damn, all right. I didn't even have to explain anything. Can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort's security protocols. And then? You will be separated from V. And Mikoshi will cease to exist. No fear. I mean, something could go wrong. Fear is the wrong word. What about the construct inside? I know you haven't told me everything. Actually, I kind of agree with that. Serious shop talk now, Alt. This is a jailbreak for the others, right? The little souls will fly free. Yes. Oh. Not good enough. I know there's more to it. Just spill it. They will become part of something greater. Nope, keep trying. Don't understand. Because it is not something you can understand. You haven't even tried him yet. Fine, have it your way. Is that everything? Are they saying whatever... Whatever we were talking about with the voodoo boys is gonna happen? Like, all those, like, AIs? Well, wait. Just one other thing. I have no more time for you. You're right, Alt's gone. We got nothing to say to each other anyways. This is kind of sad. Know what? I think you are right. Alt's gone. Oh, for Christ. Perfect. Go on. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh. Fuck this. That's sad. I think he just wanted to say something to her, but he couldn't. That's kind of fucked up. They don't know if you can hear me. Thanks for trusting me. Let's do this. I love this soundtrack. It's so the music in this game is so good. There it is. Paperwork, Asakaga, and Finch. Yeah, everything's fine. Got no reason to worry. <laughs> now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. Gotta go. I love you. Wait, Ready? Who, is, who is she talking to? Who is that? Rogue. Who is that? My son. Wasn't expecting that. You telling me you, uh, you got a, uh... Private life. Yeah. And we'll leave it at that. Fair Asked enough. If everything's ready. I didn't expect her to have a son. Yeah, it's ready. Good. Now come on, or that lunatic will take off without us. Okay. I like this joint. Gonna miss it. I, I, in a way, I do feel kind of bad because we're kind of asking Rogue to give up her, like, life to help us. You know? To the very top. Yes, ma'am. So, Wayland, what'd you tell him about the job exactly? Only what he wanted to know. His cut. Uh, alright. He any good? Aiming to be an NC legend before long. Hmm. Aren't we all? Can't help but feel like 
like deja vu. Deja vu the Johnny's memory. The first time he attacked Arasaka. Not, Not this, this time, time honey. honey. She caught us. Wayland, take us up. Copy that. Ooh, okay, here we go. Rogue. Yeah. You're pretty damn quiet. Yeah, actually. Everything chill? I just love that they're playing fucking Johnny's doing theme song. This. Just like old times, yeah? Just like old times. Oh god, I'm like, I'm excited to see what's gonna happen, but I am kind of nervous. You know what I like most about Night City? What did that be? Take a look. See that? One day you're in the gutter, the next, you got the whole city at your feet. The whole fucking city where no one can make you do shit. Not even those motherfuckers. No idea how this is gonna end, but let me tell ya, it'll be one loud morning. Time we gave this city another wake-up call. It's been 50 years! Jesus, it's so beautiful. About to get even prettier, too. The hell you say? You two take a pop at your chair <laughs> I wish, Squama. Eyes on the sky, everybody. We're literally gonna burn the city down now, aren't we? Make a wish. Whoa. Hey, they got a lock on us. Okay. Damn it. What do we do? Stick to the plan. What plan? It's already going under. Still breathing? Fuck me. Hey, Rogue's okay at least. We're good, right? Wayland never jumped. Crashed by the waterfall. I'll try to reestablish contact with him, then find someone who's got access for the elevator going down. Wayland, you read me? How many pieces you in? Still one, I owe. Oh, thank and God. I think the local tribes take an Okay, okay. In He's okay at least we'll for now. We'll get you out of there. Don't move. As if I could. We're going after Wayland. Okay, got it. We need more people to help, okay? I'm not gonna freaking leave this guy behind. Not that again. Johnny can't do this by himself. No way. Yo, we good? See if we can't use this term somehow. What? Okay, to the bird. Finally. Let's get to work. Hey, Wayland, you hear me? Loud and clear. Doors all mine. We each get one. Johnny, choice is yours. Oh, okay, I'll get this dude over here. I'm kicking up the power. Gotta get through this. Do not eat! Oh! Why do you turn around right then and there, bro? Why? Jesus Christ! Come at me! Me wait! I'm 
I didn't mean Careful. to do that. Target he out. just turned around, but you know what? Fuck it, whatever. Oh, Jesus. You were supposed to jump with us. I know. <laughs> You're like all enemies in one big puddle. Decided to ripple them out. Okay, well, um... Remind me a lot of your old man. What? But you're too young Not to... now. Oh, Let's whoops, I left that slip, sorry. Move. <laughs> I got no choice here. Open fire! The guy just walked through a crate? Holy shit! There's a guy behind me and I pressed screenshot, my bad. Go, go, go! I'm still crouched, I don't know. Get out of here. See that one? A high ranker holding the access key. Oh, yeah, I see that. Okay. I have to get out of here. Goddamn cyber psycho! Oh! You like to do that, huh? Okay. Shot! Spider Murphy love to say, look what the cat dragged in. Got your access, the access code. And make for the elevator. Got the access code. Shit. Atrium. Jesus. It was just a month ago I met with Michiko Arasaka here. Yeah, well Empty now we're hallways, blowing up this offices. place. Just like back then. Remember? Of course I do. You've changed, you know? Finally grown up. <laughs> You're still the best. Aww. So, it's kind of security sweet, rooms like the are on the lower it. level. You'll need to plow through. Plow through, you say? That's not a problem for me. Some drones here, I see. Fucking elevators are still jammed. Gotta jump. That's a long way down. Jump? Precisely why I told you to bring the antigraphs. Yes, we are. Be silent and steady now. <gasps> Which way now? Oh, Security room. Need to find the elevator Shit. to the labs. Fastest route to Mikoshi. Patching in alt. 
Let your woman out of her box. Let her show us what she's got. Hey, you've always been the one. Damn. You that, right? I do. Just a shame you never did. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Um. Well, could have been worse. All right, Alt. Do your thing. Alt's in. Think she can break through the ice? I'm pretty sure she I can. I have bypassed security. I have complete control of the building. Th that was fast. Whoa. Is clear. Whoa. Elevator. Now. I think she she's knocking out everybody. Yo, that's kind of cool. Let me steal this guy's ammo. Thank you. Yeah, she's got control over everything. Ah, oh, hell yeah. We don't gotta worry about it. Cancel her! That's so cool. We got nothing to worry about now. Holy shit, she's destroying all of them. Look at that. Netrun operations control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. 2071. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the city from certain ruin. 2074. An Arasaka. Bullshit. Know that look? Got something on your mind? Ever think back about why we did it? Did what? Why we took, took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Don't know, Johnny. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. We fought for beauty, not knowing what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treat, eh? Or people with stories of the olden days, just like my grandparents. Arisaka Netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Stop Wait, hasn't she been calling him Johnny for the Wayland he hasn't picked Continue up yet? On your way alone. I've cleared a path, but you must hurry. Okay, An thanks all. security Alt. unit is following you. Made a run for it? Wound up turret fodder. Holy fucking Christmas. Who is- Oh shit. Seems Cunningham's made strides these last Whoa! Days. She's still frying up people, you can hear it. Shit eaters never even stood a chance. Holy Come on, shit. the way down's beyond the door. Okay. Johnny, you good? Can't turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can always start over. Oh, shit! <gasps> no! Who's that? I remember you. No! Bro! Are you fucking serious? Look who we got here. Is Rogue dead? Are you built to endure? You son of a bitch! You killed my girlfriend! Ow! Where am I? Don't prolong the
just happen. <laughs> That's all you got? Fuck your mother! Second, don't I have a don't I have a, like a sniper rifle that I can use? Hello? Yeah, this. Are you built to endure? Where is he going? trying to get around. I know he's trying to get around to us. Am 
I'm making any damage on him right now. Bruh, can you like chill with the bombs? Jesus Christ alive. things off on her own terms. She did. She did. Something you'll never get. Rogue. Fuck! You were the best. I didn't want Always. her to die. I didn't want her to die. I'm sorry, he after what he just did? <coughs> oh shit. Come on, Johnny. Hey, Wayland. Oh, You're all right. Good luck, Silverman. Thanks. The access point lies before you. Link to it, insert yourself, then search for me on the other side.
I don't want to get rid of Johnny. Is that just me? I want to keep him still. What's happening? Uh. Okay, I'm Johnny. I'm not V. Just here? Oh, the bullet! What the fuck? Um... Once out of nature, I shall never take. My bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make. Of hammered gold and gold enameling. To keep a drowsy emperor awake. Or set upon a golden bough to sing. To lords and ladies of Byzantium. Of what is past or passing. Or to come. I know, I know Johnny agreed to this, but like, I really don't want to get rid of him. I know that's the whole point, because he's killing V's body, but... And I know Alt said that this is not really Johnny's an engram of what he used to be, but still, I feel like it's really him. That's the way I see it. Oh, stairs. I thought it was a door. Wait. V? Hey, V. Happy to see me? We can finally see ourselves! <laughs> Not exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything? Where'd she go? Hello? Missed my greatest performance. Rogue's gone. Had to hack my way through the jungle. Shame you couldn't watch. It was my magnum opus. You loved it. Me and yours and Rogue's, don't you? Rogue's dead. I'm sorry. Afraid things are pretty shit for me, too. Alt hit me with Soul Killer. My nerves are in shreds. Alt, gonna show yourself. Say hi, maybe? I'm an engram now. A construct. Fuck. Yeah, yeah it's weird. Welcome to the club. Hey, Alt. And that's, that's what I said. I'm like, it's not really V Tell me she's anymore finishing either. The checks on and she'll In the, the last episode that we met, uh, Alt. Soul killer. We can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties pain right now digital analgesia or data streams certain sensation inputs can be blocked blah blah yada yada alt make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture <laughs> imparted it instantly whatever she did say she'd destroy mikoshi just as you agreed gonna release all those i like how it says johnny and not me her own bosom. make them part of herself so we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. Whoa, Jesus what? Christ. Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit what it does out that mean? in human terms. V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. Are you kidding me? Check again. If V's engram is damaged, can't you fix her? Hardware. Therein lies the problem. The organism's neurons have been dying for a time. 
Any attempt at a procedure upon its brain would result in the latter's death. You're a what fucking the point genius! Of all this? Think of something! Enough! Johnny, shut up! I need to think. Gonna be alright. Think I of said, something. Give me one fucking minute. Oh, come on. There's gotta be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. What? Tell your ex to kick me out of my own body. The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. So Johnny's gonna take my body no I matter what. I will not what. interfere in your personal affairs. But while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Wait. Does Johnny still want this, though? Alt, give us a... What the hell for? So you could trick me into agreeing. I'm giving you a free pass, even though you can already do what you want with my body. No, I think I think that they're friends. I, I understand V's like anger, because now they're they're switching um, places. You're my friend, V. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Seeing as how I'm doomed to die, you stick to the plan I gave you. I leave, I you stay. <laughs> Keys to my body are yours. I mean, I want to save V, but I think it's better to let Johnny go, too. He did what he needed to do, get Smasher, have closure with Rogue. Um, now it's just confronting what happened with Alt, and the fact that he's not Johnny anymore, because he is an engram. But the ironic part is, V's an engram, too, so what does that say about her? But I think it's Johnny's time too. I don't want him to go though. No. It's gonna be me. You lying sack of shit. So what do I do, Alton? Simply cross the bridge. You will become a part of me. As V's body and former life are restored. I want to do this for me. And I know, I think Johnny would want this too. I love- Are you fucking kidding me? What? I love- I was gonna say, I love that V's theme song and Johnny's are coming together for this. They're both playing right now. There are no options, you two-faced sack of shit! Damn! You're out! I'm in! That was the deal! Wait! Wait, why are you beating me out? Isn't that what I'm doing? Okay, easy. I think too big a dose of Silverhand wound up in my blood. I need to chill. V, I'm letting you have the body! If I had to choose who to hole up with on a desert island, it wouldn't be you. Ever. No. The whole cast of little big corpo rats would have you beat. Cause you're a dickhead. In a big way. Enter the well sure, to plenty return of others to out there body. Are more no, deserving of life. But even so. I never wish you dead. I think she's just upset cause Johnny's gonna go. So the well's over there, right? And then you return to V's body, but... No, we're going into the cyberspace. Whoa! Just promise me one thing, asshole. Yeah, what? You won't forget me. Oh, I'm gonna actually cry. <laughs> I'm actually gonna cry. You will become a part of me, as V's body will form uh, and form in life will restore. It's like, oh wow, I'm actually crying. 
What the fuck? I didn't expect to cry. Wow. This is fucked up because I I I, I don't want Johnny to go either because <laughs> even though he's so annoying, like, can you imagine like having a friend like that and then all of a sudden he's gotta die too? It's like we already lost Jackie and now we're losing Johnny next. Why did I put so much makeup on? Um all of it's gonna be washed away with my goddamn tears, okay? I don't want to press the button, it's like- uh, Oh my god! I don't want to do it! Cause I don't want to leave E! I don't want Johnny to go! He's gone. What? <gasps> Judy! Morning. <laughs> She's... Morning, you. Yeah, hop in the shower. Where are we? Mm hmm. Me too. She's okay, right? Hello, Night City. Drag your asses out of your sad sack and turn to face the sky. Today and today only, you might catch a glimpse of the Crystal Palace, that big ass space station in which you mere mortals will never set foot. Now, they say the Crystal Palace has the most expensive casinos, the most beautiful women, and some damn breathtaking views. But that's what they say about Night City. Heaven on Earth, heaven in orbit. Was gazing I thought we were leaving Night City. Where the, the hell are we? Lower reaches. Life has screwed you over yet again. But for all you sitting in what the, the heck is this place? Song, here's someone you ain't heard in a while. Johnny Silverhand. Here's to you, you old bastard, wherever you are. I'm okay. <laughs> oh god, I'm I'm not okay. Fuck. <coughs> what is it? Nothing. I'm still coughing up blood. Okay. If you need me, I'll be in the kitchen. I feel like we should tell her. Why are we coughing up blood? Are you making All coffee? Right, What's wrong? Feeling worse? Nothing's wrong for a costume like nothing. I think we're still dying. I think you know what's wrong. Dying, Judy. Rather not talk about it just now. It's all Makoshi, isn't it? It's all your new meds in the bathroom. It's getting worse, right? Rather not talk about it? Not now. I want to talk about so it. So then. Yeah. I worry about you. About us. No reason to. You know what? For weeks now, I've wanted to... To just... What? Run away. 
far as I can from this fucking wall you put up between us. Can you... Anyway, I'll be outside. Maybe I'll catch a glimpse of the Crystal Palace. I do feel bad. She, she, she should be more honest with Judy. What the hell, V? That's not right to just like leave your girlfriend like that. She ob obviously she's gonna be worried about you. You know. Guess you could mistake it for Venus. V. I think I messed up. What? We're not talking about the Crystal Palace anymore, are we? It's weird as hell. But I think I might have just realized. I never felt right here. Used to think I actually liked being one atom among many. Anonymous and safe. But it was an illusion. I look at this city and feel... Like a lost atom? <laughs> Sometimes. But mostly... I feel alone. But you've got me. Yeah, I know. For a little while longer. Oh, man! You know, I used to keep time in phases. From one juncture to another. The mega building hole in the wall phase. Then the group home. The gang. The mox phase. Each and every time, I thought I'd found a home. And each and every time, Came away She's lost a lot in her life, it is true. What would you call this phase? What I wanted to talk to you about, actually. Listen, V. Are you bringing up with I me? Gotta get out of here. Ditch Night City, find something better, something more solid. You understand? Want her to leave but I, I at the same time I don't want to be like don't you know don't follow what you need because it's important in a relationship it is important if someone's unhappy they need to do something you have to like talk through it and sometimes it's the best option for that for breaking up but I still need you Judy <laughs> I want you to disappear not now I need you V you've found your place you own this city. Look at yourself. I don't want it! Queen of the afterlife. Is that why we can afford this house? Let me find out who I am. Find my truth. I mean, you know, ugh, it's so fucking hard to say. Especially to you. Thanks, Judy. For She's really me. breaking up with me. For everything. <clears throat> Whatever you're planning now. Is there any way I can help? No. It's something I gotta do on my own. So you're taking it. The job. So I gotta prove something to the city. Don't have much time. It's gotta be now. Wherever you go, won't let you forget me. If it works, I won't let you forget. You're gonna hear about me. Wherever you end up. <laughs> These postcards from the edge. I like the idea. I'll be waiting for him. Damn it! I was I was ho hoping I get a happy ending with Judy, and I I didn't. Where are you going? I know. Take care of yourself, V, and come back in one piece. You take care, too. Watch out for yourself out there, V. expect that I, I really didn't expect to get like an ending like this the afterlife head over there 
As you wish. I didn't expect us to own the afterlife, but now it makes sense why we you have so much money. Along restricted air corridors. No delays anticipated. Cream. If I may deign, you look frightfully fatigued. Was it a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. I'm truly sorry to hear that. Thanks, Delamain. The Delamain network is pleased to offer complimentary services that may just be the ideal remedy for your current condition. What's more, I'm delighted to inform you that Delamain has joined forces with Trauma Team. With our limited time only safe travels package, you have a full range of medical services available to you at your fingertips. That's any medical aid. Day late and Eddie short for that. Yeah, I'm dying. <laughs> I don't understand. You've practically unlimited resources at your disposal. I'm certain we can find an appropriate solution. Don't worry about it, Del. As you wish. What's going on with Arsaka? Now's the stitch in the city. Here's an item that might interest you. The Arasaka crisis continues. The corporation still teeters. Aggregated media mentions indicate a positively mammoth stain on the corporation's image, as well as financial and political defeat. Secure Your Soul was to be a smashing success for Arasaka. It turned into a horrific curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Huh. Mm-hmm. Promised the rich immortality. Sold him on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. Bid for control. Power, I say. Precisely. In any event, it will be some time before Arasaka successfully reorganizes. It seems you, the afterlife, are safe. For now. Get me to the afterlife. And floor it. Naturally. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. Please sit back, relax, you know, and enjoy the stunning views. Is of it our just me, city. or is it this this ending? Even though it's fucking sad, it seems more realistic for V's story. Is that just me? <sighs> Might be the last time. Like I get she's a dying. This place. She's gotta like go, to Judy. Night city. You know, one way or another. In that case, I wish you a swift return home. Thank you for choosing this the city. Delamain service. As certain of my clients nice note, is a true West Coast gem. Oh, okay. Thanks, uh -huh. Delamain. They also call it a metropolis of near paralyzing beauty. Don't doubt it. Hey, boss. Client of yours gave word he's on his way. What do I do with him? Tell him to hang tight. Be there shortly. I don't know. I just feel like this ending is a little bit realistic for the situations that we're going through. Even though I really wish we could have just run away with Judy like she said she wants to leave the city. What? Hey. Hey. We good? Perfect. Your box is ready and wait. Get you something? Yeah, actually. Um. My usual. Sure thing. People can tell something's up. Won't be able to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take off today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no. Just in that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhands preferred. Of course she did. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. You know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Mm. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking to. Johnny, Jackie, Rogue. I love all these people, like all these characters, but Johnny. So, what did hit the spot about now? Johnny's had an effect on me. Mix me up a silver hand. Drink into Johnny. I mean, I only know what people say about him, but Betty'd love what you're planning. Shit, you're over the damn moon. I know. Good luck, V. Thanks. Hey, boss. Oh, uh, Waylon, hey. Put you back together beautifully. What did I just shiny grab? new Wayland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, somehow. Anyway, I had an upper sitting on my ass in the clinic. 
feel much better here. Where you could tell everyone about your Sokka Tower heroics? Huh, <laughs> you know it. But what you plan to do today, V? I mean, respect. Nothing else will ever come close. Take good care of yourself, and good luck. Thanks. V. I've long awaited this moment. Who the hell is this To guy? look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I moved. Happy not to disappoint. Ladies first. Okay. Talk to me. Well, V. Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies. Influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the up. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Won't be disappointed. Pick the best merc around for the job. Funny enough, I mean, this so is what I've V heard, wanted in the beginning to be a legend, but I'd like right? It proved With Jackie? To me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Mm -hmm. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Crystal Palace. Whoa. Oh, we're on the carrier. What the hell? Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Satellites are down for now. Just I could have just signal. brought Judy here. She Signature would be really activated. far away from Night City. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Hmm. Tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance of extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Yeah, we have then nothing. Again, I don't have a life, I don't have friends. Uh, my girlfriend just left me. I don't know exactly what we're doing though. What the hell are we doing? Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. Cutscene with V, and we actually get to see her.
That's an interesting shot, because it's like the camera flipped, kind of like how it did with Johnny. Sandstorm's heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. That's good. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. Hey, at least I hate help Pan Am discover so I just like, want what she really you. wanted. Yeah. For all you've done for me, I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. I can't, I'm dying. <laughs> Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. Yeah, I appreciate you're them the saying Caldo. that, that remember that. we're in Alda Caldo, which is really nice. Uh, take care of yourself, V, and see you around. V, hey! Can you Bitch. hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raft and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, B. Don't know what you got on your plate right now. But remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now take care. B, hey, so River. A couple fellas from the Fifth Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron, sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought. Maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. For a good I cause. I don't even know what to say right I now. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. I want to make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. 
I don't know, I just, I guess I feel like it's kind of like, this is the best closure I could have gotten for my V. You know? And like, even though I'm sad that I didn't end up with Judy- Tag! Takemura! <laughs> they wrote to say a death poem. <gasps> it contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Wait, I forgot. Takemura is an Arasaka. I samurai, so I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell. So not only did I lose my girlfriend, I lose my friend too, right? Oh man! Damn! Hey, it's Parallas. B, you're gonna wanna hear this. First, I need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth. I told Jefferson about his his Storyline, by the way, was he's being mind controlled, and I told him about it. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab, and they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 well you got a sec. Call me, okay? Oh, yeah. And don't forget to delete this message. Jesus Christ. I think I got a really bad ending. <laughs> but at the same time, even though it looks grim, I kind of feel like this is a good ending for my V. Like, Maybe. my storyline. Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe. The world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of. I mean, that's a nice reading. But yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of like okay with this ending. I'm just sad that I couldn't get a happy ending with Judy. <laughs> and then Takimura too. But what was I supposed to do there? Be like, yo, let me go hang out with Hanako? I don't think that's the proper ending for my story. That's the way I see it. Yeah, so that's that's the ending of Cyberpunk, or at least one of the endings of Cyberpunk 2077 with my playthrough. I know people are probably gonna have different opinions about, you know, what I, I've chosen and what I've done, but I'm content with um, this ending. I just wish that Judy and I could have ended on better terms. Because if she wanted to leave and V didn't, I feel like my V would be okay with it. But they, uh, it's just sad how it ended. Alright, so since I got a little time with the credits, I guess I can give my opinion on what I thought. Clearly, you know, this game isn't the best when it, came to, when it comes to gameplay. And I know it had a really rough, rough launch, but aside from all of that, I think this is one of my favorite games that I have played in a really, really long time. The storytelling of this game was incredible. Um, not only because of like the choices that you can make, but the angles of like what CD Projekt Red was trying to invoke on how society is. But not only that, people trying to find themselves too. Like even though Johnny may seem like this monolith of a type of person very confident whatever he's still human at the end of the day and i really like that they broke down his like rock star persona into this person who is genuinely hurt and confused and he managed to redeem himself by saving v in the end and even though you know i didn't get like a happy ending for my v I feel like for the story that was being told and the choices that I was making, I feel like that's a more realistic ending I could give her because she's still dying regardless. She she trusted Johnny to help and he came through. People that we cared about, example Judy, she didn't die or anything like that. We may not have ended up with her, but at least she's gonna be able to go on her own path. I think the reason why I got this ending I know people are gonna say river, but I have a second say, but I just want to clarify that. I think it's because of the fact that I chose to trust Johnny instead of like picking different path, like going to Hanako, which probably would have saved- I don't know if Takimoto's alive or not, but that probably would have saved him. And also, not giving us a big name like it did, because we fulfilled Johnny's quest, which is like taking down Arasaka, burning the city, 
and making a name for herself. And that was kind of uh, V's goal in the beginning of the game. She wanted to make a name for herself and she compared herself to Johnny Silverhand when her and Jackie were having a drink at the afterlife. We kind of got what we wanted, it's just not in the ideal, idealistic way. And I, you can say that about life, you never get what you really want, you know what I mean? As uh, dark as that sounds, but you know. I feel like that was the best ending I could have gotten for my story. The writing for this is incredibly beautiful. Like, I personally enjoyed v, female V's voice acting. Her ability to express emotion through what we're saying and everything like that. I just loved it. The romances were really great too. I wish they were longer. Especially like, Junie's is really sweet and really down to earth. Even though it was really sad like what she had to go through. But I really loved it. Obviously my criticisms are the glitching. I really wish we could have customized V. Not just at the beginning where we created our character. I wish we had more time with Jackie. You know what I mean? Like that whole flash, like the whole sequence montage of whatever we had with Jackie. Wish we could have lived that out with him. But hanging around Johnny Silverhand, I don't know. I just really loved him as a character. Like not because it's Keanu Reeves. I know we all love him. I love him too. His way of like trying to express as Johnny, even though Johnny's like a huge asshole. He's such an asshole, but I enjoyed his company. Like his commentary throughout everything was really funny. It made me laugh. Um, yeah, I did get mad at him too. And then, yeah, I cried at the end for him because he's gone. And and it's sad because in reality, that, that wasn't really Johnny. It was just an, an ingram of him. But I would like to believe that was Johnny, regardless of what Alt was saying. But yeah, I just really, I think the, the strongest suit in this was the writing and the music. The music was incredible too. Uh, the soundtrack fits everything. I, I love that they put at the ending V's theme and Johnny's theme together. That was just perfect. I, I thought that was great. Okay, guys, that is going to be the end of my Let's Play for Cyberpunk 2077. I really hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough. Um, I'd like to hear your thoughts on my ending or whatever ending you got. Uh, I, I want to know what your decision was at the end there. I don't know. I just feel like going with Johnny was my personal take and I, that's the reason why I went with it. Even though it cost me Judy, I still think it was the right thing to do for my V. I look forward to the future of Cyberpunk with the DLC, so whenever those come out, I will definitely be playing that. But yeah, I just want to give a thank you to CD Projekt Red, despite, you know, everything that's happened with the launch. I still appreciate the developers for making such a wonderful game, such a wonderful story. This is definitely one of my favorite games that I've played recently, so... I really enjoyed it, and I really hope you guys enjoyed watching it too. With that being said, if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like, let me know in the comments what you think, and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so whenever I play the DLC of Cyberpunk, you can watch it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!